let me show you how I usually work with the EcoStructure Machine Expert HBAC. Once we install the software, we can have this direct access to this folder, which include the EcoStructure Machine Expert HBAC installer and the EcoStructure Machine Expert HBAC. We can think as the installer as a manager for projects. So let's just open it. Here we can add our devices. So we're going to start with this one, the M172, the smaller one, the 14, accept. Now I'm going to add this one, the bigger one. And now we're going to add a display. So in this part of the installer, we can think as a manager for, for different projects. For example, we know that the M172 is oriented for the HVAC machines. So I can change this name, for example, to PLC Jailer. And I can change this to PLC Rooftop. and display chiller. So we have different projects in one manager, okay, in this manager. So we can get access later to the program of all of this. What I'm gonna do now is to save the manager in this folder that I had created. So as machines. The file is the .cfn. Now we have already created this manager for prospects, and we see the PLCs. Let's take a look on this. Here, we have selected this range, but it doesn't care if it has a display or not, or even if it's the one with seven or eighteen IOs. Now, if we want to program this PLC, what we need to do is to select PLC chiller, go to PLC, and open. We don't have anything here, so we need to create the instance of the machine expert. So, we can name this, and then click OK. This action helps us to open the EcoStructure Machine Expert HBAC. So let's save this and verify what do we have here in the initial folder. Let's close the installer, save the machine, close. This is the folder that I created before and here I saved the project. See that we have the CF, see that we have the CFN file for the installer, and then just one folder for the PLC chiller. Now, if I open the installer, we can see here that we have all the elements, but there is no PLC rooftop folder created because we haven't linked to any application. So. Imagine now that instead of using the installer, I'm going to use the EcoStructure Machine Expert HBAC. So let's open this. I'm going to select this PLC and name as Rooftop. And the directory would be. Training machine along with this one. Create. So 
we have created a new program using only the eco-structure machine expert HBAC and not the installer. So if we go to the folder where I create my machines, we can see now that we have the PLC chiller and PLC rooftop. So if I want to link the complete, so if I want to link the PLC rooftop to my original EcoStruction Machine Expert HBAC installer, we can close this, save the project, open the EcoStruction Machine Expert HBAC installer, select the PLC rooftop. We can check here that we don't have anything. We can browse and select the one that we have created as a standalone. And now I can open using the Machine Expert installer. And this is the same program as the other one that I opened standalone. It's the same project. So my recommendation is to use the EcoStruction Machine Expert HVAC installer to manage your projects so we can get access to the machine that we want in an easy way.